Zora's domain is absolutely gorgeous as hell in this game. In Ocarina of Time, they just like live in a cave, and then in Breath of the Wild, they have the most elaborate looking domain in existence. It's their domain, it's the Zora's website. The Zoras live on a website. Yeah, that's a nice statue. The rain never huh. goes away, nor comes out another day. Whoa! Huh. I'll look at our bandana. I've been waiting for you, Link. Welcome. Behold the pride of my people. Zora's domain. Now I shall introduce you to the king. Hurry this way. He says hurry, and then he walks slower than I've ever seen anyone walk in my whole life. <laughs> we did it. What's up, guys? Howdy, and eh? I believe this is our first meeting, yes? My name is Dunma. Huh? Why did I ask her gender? What? My, how observant you are. Is there a problem? Why is Link out here asking people's genders? What the fuck? How old are you? This is not an appropriate question to ask a lady you've just met. <laughs> Let's just say I'm less than a hundred years old. Can't you tell? I'm so much less formal than the elders, aren't I? Mm. At any rate, right now Zora's domain is looking for a Hylian warrior. For more detailed information, please go back and speak with Korn. I just called him Korn. All right, for more information, go see King Dorfian. Huh? What is it? Master Link? Is it truly you, the Hyrule champion? It's me, Riven. We used to swim together when I was but a child, remember? Let's play along. Well, it has been a hundred years since then, and now I'm over 130 years old. I must say you've aged well for a Hylian, unbelievably well. Now that I think about it, shouldn't you be dead? Sorry, that may be too personal of a question. Uh, father, we are on guard duty right now. Oh, right, sorry. Dude, father and daughter doing guard duty together? Interesting. My father Trello, they have all aged quite a bit, I'm afraid. But they are all doing well. Uh... Oh, but Master Link, you probably shouldn't speak to the elderly. Oops, sorry for keeping you too long. You have business in the throne room, right? Please proceed there at your earliest convenience. Don't talk to the elderly? I thought we're supposed to respect the elderly. Oh, it's you. We met at Zora River. It's me, Leto. Thank you for coming so quickly. But enough about me. Could I possibly ask you to go and meet King Dorfian? Mm. He's in the throne room. What is he carving? Is he just like stylizing the pillar? Very sick. The damage is minimal. What happened? Good morning. Mm -hmm. Are you a Hylian? Yeah. Uh. Oh, where are my manners? I am La Flat. Girl, you don't look La Flat to me. Oh, where are my manners? I am the chief secretary for the royal family. Mm. Are you curious about the statue of Lady Mifa? Yeah, I am pretty by curious. If you do not mind, please allow me to explain. This is the statue of the former Zora champion. Her name was Lady Mifa. Ah. She was as kind as she was beautiful. They say her ability to heal wounded soldiers was beyond compare. Uh. Those soldiers she healed they are old and decrepit now, but they remember. For this reason, the elders of the domain all love Lady Mifa dearly. If you would like to know more, I suggest you try talking to one of them. That is a really pretty statue. I like how it glows at the bottom. All right, let's go ahead and do the shrine first. Shrine number four. Let's get it over with. Knees, nuts, yoma. All right, here we go. This is a very obnoxious shrine from what I remember. You get hit and knocked down by a bunch of balls. Let's see how much I can remember from this. Okay, from what I remember, our goal is to get this ball at the top. What the heck? I don't know if this is the safest way to get up here. Uh. What? 
And it's the way we're taking right now, so let's just get up here. <laughs> Push it out. Bloop. And then if I push it up, it's gonna go down this little slide, down the ramp. Let's go ahead and just open this chest. Might as well. You can open it from the back. That's kind of funny. Ah! Why? Drop in the little boomerang for the sphere. Okay, so it's gonna come down here. What is the... What does this laser do? I'm not really sure what the point of that is. All right, here we go. It's about to, oh wait, I should have made the... Stop it, stop it. Perfect. Okay. Let me make this. Is it gonna get stopped in the right spot? I think I can break this one. I hope. Keep going. Oh my gosh. You really doing this to me right now? No, don't push it that way. Please don't push it that way. Go. 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 I said move it. Oh my gosh. It's so heavy. Is it gonna go far enough? It is, okay. So I'm gonna have to cryonis it and then get ready to stasis. Okay, don't mess up the timing. Perfect. Okay, don't wanna hit it too hard. Maybe it's like two times. That should be enough. Oh, yes! Freaking killed it! Whew! I'm a ball slayer. Alright, what's this shaman? How is he sitting? Drip drop. Hit him with the drip drop. He's doing like some weird, just like holding the ring from an upside down. And there's four more orbs. Look at you guys talking about good television shows. Just so you guys know, when I re-edit these videos back, I do read the chat like pretty closely <laughs> so I can like see all the things that I miss. Cause it's really entertaining. I like to like recap my journey so then it helps like reinforce the things that I did and I remember better so I can give like better and more present commentary. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Oh, wait, we have a Goron in here. Hello? What are you doing in here, bud? You talk to me. Ooh. Hey, you're a Hylian. It's rare to see your kind around here. <laughs> I was roaming nearby when Prince Sidon recruited me and brought me here. That's because I can touch shock arrows, but I also weigh, well, a lot. There's no way I'll be able to carry you on my back. That's what Prince Sidon said to me. That was kind of rude of him, wasn't it? <laughs> I think so, yes. Very, very rude. How dare he? Dinto. So, the Hylian who stole Lady Mipha away thinks he can just come wandering in here like nothing happened. What business do you have here after all these years? What is this place? The Weapons Workshop. What are you doing? Trident maintenance. A trident? The light scale trident and the ceremonial trident. You have been making a racket since you walked in here. There is no point in coming in here if you do not possess the light scale trident. Leave. No. Dinto is a grumpy old man. I want to buy anything right now. Could buy more arrows, but I feel like I have enough arrows right now, honestly. Let's see how like accurate I can be. Fortunately, the people who watch on YouTube and leave comments really pay attention, and they'll usually prevent me from like missing any important stuff in the long run. It's pretty great. Yeah! Why do you keep touching it? 
He's just a sucker for pain. I, Segan, the aptly named Demon Sergeant, shall strike down the divine beast Varuta. What you doing? <laughs> what? You, your Link. I can avenge Lady Mifa, finally. It has been 100 years since you last showed your face around here. Now I, Sejin, will cut you down myself. What? <laughs> Plain dumb, eh? Nice try, but you cannot fool me, champion Link. You were unable to protect Lady Mifa from Calamity Ganon. <sighs> it has been a hundred years since we lost her. How heartbreaking. <laughs> hmm. There is no way we would ask for your help now after all this time and after all that has happened. So says I, Segan, the demon sergeant. Even if this body of mine is destroyed, I will drown Ruta in shock arrows myself. And in doing so, Lady Mifa's regrets shall be alleviated. <laughs> if you understand anything of courage, then get out of my way at once. Okay, keep touching your shock arrow, you freaking wacko. He is being racist against the Hylians. I'm not sure if it's all Hylians. I think it's just targeted at Link. This water is so gorgeous. Why does Nintendo ever have... Like, Nintendo always has such good water textures. Even in games that aren't HD. It's wild. Whoa, King Dorfian, he's so big. And we know why he has the scar on his face now, too. It was that a sea flap flap? Just walking around? Stingray face? Mm -hmm. Oh, you must be the Hylian that Sidon brought here, correct? You did well to come all the way here. <laughs> Yarp, I am King Dorfian, ruler of the Zoras. Hmm, that object upon your waist. Hmm? Now that I have gotten a clear look at you, it is too clear who you are. Do not tell me that you have forgotten me. The Hylian Champion, you can't mean the Link. Damn, I don't know why people expect everybody in this world to have 100 year long memory. I guess maybe they don't have iPhones to like turn their brain into mush. So I guess they have longer memories. I don't know. I cannot believe it. The Hylian Champion Link has appeared before us. We have met numerous times, I'll have you know. Oh, so many memories. My mind is overflowing with nostalgia, my friend. I had heard a terrible rumor that you had fallen in combat, but it appears you have managed to survive. Extraordinary. Yeah, I've been sleeping. I've been zzz -z -zing. <laughs> Link does kind of look like Jesse McCartney. That's actually a great comparison. I was trying to think, I'm like, who does Link look like? Jesse McCartney. Throwback. Come again, sleeping, you say? Hmm. Is that why you do not seem to remember me? But surely you must remember my precious daughter, Mifa. Yes, you do. Do you not? Uh, doesn't ring a bell. Well, I think that offends him. <laughs> I cannot believe it. Have you truly forgotten my dear Mifa as well? You were so close, yet you do not remember her. Young hero, please look upon the beauty of Zora's domain. Do you see that statue? Does gazing upon Mifa's immortalized form still not jog your memory? Well, perhaps your memory will return in time. I dearly hope so. Father, I do not believe discussing my sister is helping matters at the moment. Link seems confused. Oh, yes, of course. But first, it is worth noting how remarkable it is that Sidon brought a champion here without even realizing it. That is quite a feat, my boy. Ha <laughs> ha. That is a good one. Link, I doubt not that you have endured a great many trials. Still, I must ask you to hear my plea. Mm. Now then, hero, I must inform you that Xor's domain is in danger of vanishing because of divine beast Varuta. I shall do you the courtesy of speaking bluntly. We alone cannot stop this beast. Mm -hmm. Will you lend us your strength? <laughs> what? <laughs> King Dorfian, my liege, please do not speak so. To ask a Hylian for help? Why, the very thought of it curls my fins. Mm -hmm. Muzu, I expected more of you. How can you still protest? Uh. Muzu, it is rude to speak that way to your king and his guests. Link is here because I invited him. With such, with such, unprecedented, with such unprecedented rainfall, we have no choice but to rely on the aid of a trustworthy Hylian. Have we not already discussed this and arrived at that very conclusion? He is the key to saving King Domain. King, he is the king. Yeah, whatever. 
Indeed, Link is a champion through and through. As things now stand, Zora's domain, nay, perhaps all of Hyrule is doomed to be swallowed by the sea. This is bigger than all of us, my friend. Zoras and Hylians alike must put aside our differences and band together. Have you already forgotten, my king? We cannot trust these lowly Hylians. Damn, how come old people are always just so on edge and racist? <laughs> I like how much, like, political discourse they decided to throw into the Zelda game, but in, like, their own unique ways. A hundred years ago, they abused the power of an ancient civilization and turned Hyrule into what it is today. And that is not the least of it. He feels so defeated. It is their fault that Lady Mifa was lost to us. Divine Beast Varuta has great power. It has the unique ability to create an endless supply of water. Of late, it has been mercilessly spouting water into the air. As a result, this area has been plagued by heavy rains. For Azora, water and air as of one. So you would not think this would be quite so critical of a problem. But sadly, the rains have filled the eastern reservoir nearly to the point of flooding. If the reservoir bursts, as it soon will, I fear immense damage will befall not only Zora's domain, but also the area downstream from us. There, Hylian lives are in the very grave danger. Oh, we hear the first elephant roar. Hmm, the divine beast is crying out. That is the biggest damn damn I've ever seen. Yo, peekaboo. This thing just lives under the water like that? Damn, bitch, you live like this? Aren't you gonna get all moldy and everything? We gotta feed the streets. The Divine Beasts are so cool. Such sick creatures. We gotta feed the streets. Mm. The Divine Beast, Varuta. Your Princess Zelda often studied the Divine Beasts. That is, in the time before the Great Calamity. According to her research, the orbs located on Ruta's shoulders are mechanisms that, contr that control the water it generates. However, they require electricity to work. These orbs are clearly out of control now because there is no electricity coursing through to stop them. Oh. Sejin, who is quite shock resistant for Azora, hit one with a shock arrow. Sure enough, it slowed the water a bit. Unfortunately, as an aquatic race, we Zora are terribly vulnerable to the power of electricity. Perhaps because we could not safely strike it with enough electricity at once, the water soon returned to its full force. Huh. That is why I went in search of a Hylian who could help us. Link, I am certain you have already figured this out, but we need you to use shock arrows to get those orbs working properly again. Mm. I will aid you in any way I can, of course. Please, Hero, I beg of you. Help me stop Ruta's rampage of destruction. Link is standing with his chest out hardcore. Great posture. I... yeah. What? Princess Zelda herself instructed you to board the Divine Beast and appease it from within? So then, Princess Zelda is still alive? I guess so. I do not believe it. She was alive this whole time, just as you are. The events of 100 years ago cannot be altered. It is true. But if we can regain control of the, the Divine Beasts, they may yet prove useful in sealing Calamity Ganon once and for all. Huh. I did not know you had such great ambitions, Link. <laughs> Wondrous. Naturally, I shall help too. Once it has stopped rampaging, you can easily climb inside. Come, Link. Let us appease Roots together. <laughs> the bromance that we deserve. Thank you, Link. Truly, we are in your debt. Our goal is the same. That means our meeting was nothing short of destiny. Now then, allow me to offer you this gift as a show of faith. That's what's up, Zora Armor. This stuff is so cool. As long as you wear this, you can ascend waterfalls just like a Zora. Please take good care of it. Gengorfian! Surely you do not really intend to give that outside of the Zora armor! Countless generations of Zora princesses have gifted that armor to the one they have sworn to marry. Princess Mifa made this one with her own hands. It is far too important to entrust the shady Hylian. 
He may be a champion, but Miva had no such relationship with him. So why should he receive such an honor? Uh. This is just too much, my liege. I do not understand it one bit. Mm. I like how he cares more about the honor and his traditions, more than keeping the whole entire kingdom of Hyrule alive. Whatever. That Muzu is not easily swayed once his mind is set. You must understand. He was in charge of educating my dear daughter, Mifa. Naturally, she means a lot to him, just as she means the world to us. Ever since we lost her to the Calamity, he has grown to despise Hylians. I hope you can forgive his rudeness. But what shall we do now? I tasked Muzu with finding the Shock Arrows. We will be needing to appease Varuta. But now he has rushed off in a huff. Link, do not let his words concern you. I will work with us out with Muzu. I shall return shortly. Damn, so much conflict, so much drama. Why can't we just be friends, homies? Eat some quesadillas, watch the sunset. It'd be great. Link, Muzu is most likely at the square down below. Would you mind going down there? I would like you to try to speak with him. You want me to get even more involved with this drama? All the old people here want to see me dead. That's what it seems like. I'm gonna land on his head. <laughs> Die, turn you into some freaking sushi. See how see what he thinks of me now. You came all the way here, but it was in vain. I have no desire to speak with you. Listen well, Muzu, there is something you need to know. He who stands here, the man called Link, is the one whom my sister. Mifa had feelings for. I was only a child then, so I did not know it myself at the time, but it is so. I grew up hearing my father tell stories, some of which were about my sister's undying love for a Hylian named Link. What? No! <laughs> he can't handle it. You cannot fool me with such a fanciful lie, not this Zora. How could Lady Mifa possibly have feelings for a Hylian like him? The facts are clear. He remembers nothing even when he looks upon Princess Mifa's statue. <sighs> it is the truth, Muzu. Though you've never knew it, he was ever in Mifa's heart. Link is like, damn. I had this fine fish stick. <laughs> is Link feeling something? <laughs> it was Mifa a freak for real? What do you feel, Link? Whoa, what's happening? Damn, are they gonna smash? That's cool, they're just sitting on the trunk of the elephant. I was thinking, this reminds me of the time we first met. You were just a reckless child. Always getting yourself hurt at every turn. Why do Zora's love Link so much? Every time. I would heal you, just as I'm doing right now. I thought it was funny how, being a Hylian, you looked grown up so much faster than I did. I was... I was always willing to heal your wounds. Even back then. Zoras have a thing for Link for sure. So if this calamity Ganon does this in fact return, making my eye itchy. what can we really do? We just don't seem to know much about what we'll be up against. But know this, that no matter how difficult this battle might get... Do you guys like her voice you, acting? If anyone ever tries to do you harm, then I will heal you. They should have had me voice no actor. No when, or how bad the wound. I hope you know that I will always protect you. Yeah, I feel like Once her voice is kind of weird. Is over, maybe things can go back to how they used to be when we were young. You know. Perhaps we could spend some time together. Yeah, they should have had me a voice actor. Missed opportunity. What is the matter, Link? 
Are you unwell? <clears throat> you are quivering like a hatchling. Whatever is the matter? I remember. What? Do not mistake me for a fool, Hylian. There is no way you remembered her just now when it is most convenient. In any case, without any solid proof, I cannot possibly take you at your word. If you have any such proof, now is the time to show it. Do so and I, I shall tell you how to get those shock arrows. Yes, as well as anything else you wish to know. Uh, how do I do this? The stubborn fool. Lucky for us, we have proof. Link, go ahead and show Muzu the Zora armor my father gave you. Oh yeah, cause she made it for us, huh? It fits perfectly. Hmm. Muzu, look closely at the clothes Link is wearing. Hmm. Hmm. You really think changing your clothes is gonna make me... Hmm. Eh? Hmm. What in the... That is the Zora armor from before. Lady Mifa made that by hand. And yet, it fits so perfectly. What is the meaning of this? Hmm. Now you understand, do you not? Now you know who her heart belonged to and who she made this special armor for. The fact that this armor fits Link perfectly should be proof enough that Mifa made it for him and him alone. You have always disliked Hylians, even before the Great Calamity. This is why Mifa never told you. Now that you know, you must promise to help him save all of us, Muzu. Please, tell us where we can find the shock arrows we need. Knowing you, I bet you have already figured it out. Ugh, I never would have imagined she would have made that special armor for one such as he. His mind's being blown to smithereens. Everything he's known for the past 100 years is false. Can he accept his wrongdoing? Or is he gonna stench in his discourse? I do not approve of asking for help from a Hylian, but I suppose it is our only option at this point. I am a proud Zora. That means I must take responsibility for my unwarranted behavior towards you. As promised, I shall tell you where the where you can collect as many shock arrows as you will need. Ah. Alright, this part's really cool. That tall mountain over yonder, it is called Ploimus Mountain. I thought it was like polyamorous mountain for a second. <laughs> and then you shall find Shatterback Point. A terrifying creature has made his home up there. This awful beast shoots volley after volley of shock arrows. Even a single one could be fatal to Azora. Uh. Aha! You must mean that Lionel. He is a man beast, that one. The beast does indeed wield shock arrows. That is certainly one way to collect them quickly. He is vicious, to be sure, but I am certain Link will rise to the challenge. In order to appease the divine beast, I estimate that you will need at least 20 shock arrows. Do you think you can gather that many? Why do you still doubt him, Muzu? I have no doubt he will be triumphant. Hmm. Okay, Link, let's get moving. The fastest way to Ploimus Mountain is to ascend the waterfall east of the domain. That Zora armor should come in handy. Just swim to the waterfall basin and then go up the waterfall from there. Oh. I'll wait at East Reservoir Lake, right by the Divine Beast. Gather at least 20. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got you, man. Together we shall stop the Divine Beast onslaught. The drip drip. <gasps> you guys are freaking too much. Oh, look at the little Zora kid. Hi. Tumbo. What is it? Oh, hey, mister. Hey? You've got a weird face. Hey? Hi, Leon? Never met one of those before. Aww. If you're a high Leon, that means you came from a really far away array, right? You didn't happen to see my mom, Mai, on the way here, did you? Ever since the water monster went crazy, mom hasn't come home. Mm. But I mean, I bet she'll come home sooner or later. Hopefully sooner. Yo, poor kid. What about this one? Kiyi, good day. Um, who are you? Oh, uh, so you're a Hylian. Did you come from far away? I guess because my... Oh, never mind. My dad told me not to talk to strangers. Wow. This kid is dealing with it. That's actually some real stuff right there. Is this a Zora right here? Is he also just working? Frank? His name is Frank. <laughs> it's like the funniest spin off of Frank ever. 
My apologies. I was lost in thought. Okay, Frank. Have fun. We'll miss you. Oh. Let's take a picture of the little Krabby Patty. Before he goes and hides his secret formula. Bright eyed crab. That reminds me of a blue eyes white dragon. In its own unique way. Well, this is kind of cool. It's a little water slide. So much fun. Kind of confused by the purpose of that. Zora's domain is overall pretty tiny, I'm pretty sure. Baz, hello and welcome. Zora's domain is currently searching for a Hylian like you. That said, this Hylian, I get the feeling I've seen him before, perhaps a long time ago. Oh, another crab? Different color of crab. Oh, wait, no, that's not a crab. What is that? Chickaloo tree nut. <laughs> the way those were arranged looked like a crab. There's another crab. Have I missed anything important in here? Another kiddo. You should go to sleep soon. Well, who are you telling to go to sleep? Excuse your ass. Oh, hi. What's up? Hello. Welcome to Sea Bed Inn. Here we. Could it be Linny? Is it? It's Linny. Wait. They call me Linny? Yes, I'm sure of it. You're Linny. Wow, it's been such a long time. Wait, but. I thought you and me have failed to claim it again, and, but if you've been alive all this time, then where have you been? What have you been doing? Please tell me. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm an adult, and yet here I am making a ruckus. Has it really been a hundred years? In a way, it feels like yesterday. Oh. We've both been through a lot, I'm sure. If you don't mind, I'd love to catch up sometime soon. Koda. I like her name. It's a cool name. Hey. Welcome to the Seabed Inn. Wait, it can't be that everyone's like freaking out. Back to work and go. We're always happy to provide some sound sleep to weary travelers. Welcome to Sea Bed Inn. Uh, yes, I would love to. The blissful waterbed? Wait, what? You wish to know about our waterbed? Well, as the name implies, it is a bed filled with water. It conforms to the shape of your body, so it's like being wrapped up in a cocoon as you sleep. Very calming. <laughs> oh, it's an incredible cooling effect, promising a level of sleep and comfort you simply can't find elsewhere. Okay, even though I have like no money right now, I'm going to splurge and get a water bed because we did a lot of traveling today. And I also just want to see what it looks like because I've never done this before. Oh. Please sleep well until morning. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what the, what was that sound? It looked, it sounded like Link was getting zoinked. <laughs> what in the world? I guess he was having a lot of fun on the waterbed is what it sounded like. Okay. Good for you, Link, I guess. Is this a Zora toilet? Oh, it's a pot. Has it been used as a toilet? Oh, she freaked out. My bad, girl. Good morning, Lenny. You went for the waterbed, right? How did you sleep? Oh, great. Oh, I'm so glad. I knew it was worth the investment to have a bed made especially for Hylians. Just, just for Hylians? That's great. I like the little lunar lamps. Those are really pretty. The Goron's still back there. Have I talked to her yet? Oh, good morning. Welcome to Marrow Mart. This is where you'll find our general store, the Coral Reef. Our workshop, the hammerhead is also here. Ah. Um, anything special about this place? Yup, the general store and the workshop, they're the best shops ever. And together they're called Marrow Mart. Marrow Mart, lady da -de da, lady da. That's my theme song, isn't it cute? Is there anything else you'd like to ask me? I think I'm good, <laughs> see ya. All right, and I think I'm good on this play session of Breath of the Wild as well. Let's see, what do we accomplish this play session? I want to actually see 
how much I filled the comp I can never pronounce it. The compendium. Okay, we have five on this first page, two on the second page, three, no, three on that page, two on this page, two monsters, two monsters, four materials, two materials, five equipment, one equipment, one equipment, one, four, one, five, and then a treasure chest. Cool. At that, we got uh, four shrines completed, the Dashika Tower, several side quests. So I'm feeling pretty good. Anyways, make sure to press the thumbs up button if you enjoyed the video. Hit subscribe so you're notified when I post more. And we'll catch you in the next one. Peace. I'll get the heart container next time. Gotta save the heart container.